Hello and welcome to Miami, very hot, very steamy, beautiful Florida. My name is Patrick Simpson-Jones. Down here they call me Ranger Pat and I am the owner and the inventor of the Swing Beep Teaching Aid. Good morning from Miami Beach Golf Club. My name is Scott Matuza and I'm the owner and lead instructor at Two's Golf Academy. Swing Beep is very probably the smallest, most effective and inexpensive golf teaching aid which will come out on the market in 2016. Swing Beep right now is being talked about through all the top professionals in South Florida and soon to be all over the country. It exposes the seven cardinal sins in the golf swing that most amateurs and some professionals make on an everyday basis in this game. And when I say small, I kid you not. This is the Swing Beep and this is how it works. Smaller than a $1 coin, it is comprised of three main separate elements. A 3 and a 16 inch carbon graphite rod, the Swing Beep module itself and finally a magnet. When a club shaft, putter shaft or body part hits this rod in a three-dimensional manner, i.e. upwards, downwards or sideways, it giving you an immediate audible feedback on whether you have correctly or incorrectly performed a swing, stroke or body movement. Swing Beep has this little magnet that you can attach to almost anything. Your alignment stick, your shaft, it attaches to almost anything so that you can work on your swing. Cuddleson number one, the overswing. Firstly, I have secured the swing beep on the side of my cap by placing the magnet on the inside lining of the said cap or visor. From this position, I'm just going to demonstrate what swing beep does when your wrists break down. That tells me I'm in a bad spot, but if I do the right thing, it doesn't beep. Cuddleson number two, acceleration through impact. With swing beep in this segment, we're discussing how most golfers decelerate or stop the club going through the impact zone. And what Swing Beep helps us out with is it tells us if we're not swinging through or not. If you don't hear the beep, you're not swinging through it. Cardinal sin number three, the sway. The slider can be placed at any height, using for juniors, adults, seniors, anything. It simply just slides up and down. The device attaches, goes in the ground, and we start just like that. I'm now able to attach this to my alignment stick and when I don't do what's right and my body sways, I sway into it and it beeps. Cardinalson number four, hanging back or lack of transfer of weight onto the front foot. In this segment, we're gonna go over the weight transfer. About 90% of amateur golfers don't transfer their weight. They leave it back on their right foot. What swing beep is helping out is, is I can hear the swing beep as I go through it. So as I set up for my swing, I set, I know I get to the top, and as I transfer my weight, I hear the swing beep go. So this way I know I'm in the perfect setting. Cardinal sin number five, over the top. In this segment, we're working on the over the top move to keep everybody from doing it. So what happens is most golfers, they bring that club so far inside that they can't move it from the inside. They have to come over the top and swing beep tells us that we've come over the top and we've hit it. What most golfers need to do is they need to get in this position and have a straight square face and come through and swing beep doesn't sound because I hit it perfect. And now let's go to the green for one of the most important exercises for all beginners and even sometimes pros. Cardinal sin number six, acceleration through impact with the putter. For this exercise, we'll be using the slider on the tee because most greens keepers may not be too happy about you using an alignment stick and poking it in their perfectly groomed surface. Here we have a 15 foot putt with swing beep. We're gonna show you what swing beep really works with the follow through. If you're doing the right follow through, swing beep will beep. Most of the problem with amateur golfers is getting the ball to the hole and getting your follow through done. What I can also do is a lot of people have a problem of the backswing and they go too far back and they jab. So what swing beep is really good for is knowing how far back you're going and you can visually hear it and see it. And last, but certainly not least, something which all beginners, intermediate players, and even pros do, and which usually results in many catastrophes, cardinal sin number seven, the breaking of the wrist whilst chipping or putting. For this exercise, we will use the Velcro bracelet included in the swing beat pack and place the magnet underneath it. We will also use the shorter carbon fiber graphite rod also included in the pack. So it shows if you break your wrist, it goes off. We don't want you to break your wrists. If I swing this putter nice with my cross-handed stroke, this shouldn't go off. But if I break my wrists, 
it's going to tell me that I'm doing wrong. In this segment, we have the typical pitch shot that about 90% of amateurs have a problem with. And what they do is they break their wrist coming through. So the object of swing beep is not to have it beep. So if you come through and you break your wrist, she's going to beep on you. But if you swing it the right way and get it to go straight down the line, it's not going to beep and your shot's going to be perfect. I hope now that everybody has a perfect understanding of how the swing beep works and its technologies and the advantages it's going to have with its clients. But also the organizers of the 450,000 amateur golf tournaments held every year worldwide. I'm sure that the latter will agree that swing beep is a great and durable way of showcasing their brand. Finally, as we showed you with every cardinal sin, swing beep takes care of every angle and every section of your golf swing. There are many different training aids out there, but I advise that everybody picks up a swing beep because this will help you from the top of your game to the bottom of your game. So we thought a quick price comparative might be instructive and informative. The advantage of the swing beep is what we really like is it's great for juniors. Is we're able to sit here and work on their work on their swings from the putting all the way up to the driver and have fun and make a game out of it. One kid makes it beep, the other one's gonna want to make it beep. And although swing beep is first and foremost a golf teaching aid, there's no doubt in my mind that other sports will use swing beep as well as other domains such as physical rehabilitation, gymnastics, or exercising. That's all for me. Thanks for watching. God bless. Cheers.